I don't even remember when I dyed this, but it's definitely been too long. Clearly, um, it's faded quite a bit. This part is like turning yellow. Um, we've got some brown in here. The only part that kind of stayed vibrant is like under here for some reason. I don't know why. I appreciate all the compliments on my hair, but uh, personally, I think it looks terrible. <laughs> I just really want it to be more one solid color. I hate all the brown and all the like weird yellow and stuff in it. So I went to Sally's and they actually didn't have light blue, which was the color that I used before. Um, so I got two blues and one neon blue. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to section my hair like this. I'm going to do blue down here and then mix the neon and the blue and do that up here. Does that make sense? I don't know, you'll see. Okay, let's section my hair. Okay, let's do it like this. So, put these aside and then I'm just gonna take blue because I think this is the darker one. I hope this time I do have enough dye. I got three containers instead of one. It's gotta be enough, right? This is what it looks like in the bowl. It's really pretty. I don't know if I should bother putting it over the roots. I don't know how dark this color is gonna come out, um, but I might try just in case. Weird animal sounds. Okay. So I did the bottom half. Um, I still actually have quite a bit left over. So what I'm going to do is just like mix them all together in here. Just make a huge bowl of hair dye. Now for the neon. That's what it looks like. Okay, that's a lot of dye, so I think this time it's gonna be enough. It better.
Okay, I think it's all in there. I hope I didn't miss any spots. I have a lot of dye left over, like a lot. Opposite problem of last time. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I left it in for about an hour and 20 minutes. I meant to leave it in for an hour, but I got distracted playing Pokemon, so I ended up leaving it in for an hour and 20. This is how it turned out. I'll show you the back. I am really happy with it. It's definitely way more dark and vibrant than the light blue that I was going for originally. Um, but I actually really like this. I think I like it better. I like that it covers all of the brown spots pretty much. I mean, there is still some color difference here as you can tell. Like this is a really dark blue. Um, if you look close you can still see like the brown. But I think it just like goes together a lot better and I think it looks good. I'm really happy with it. It kind of reminds me of a couple years ago I did splat in I think dark blue or something and it was like really pigmented and vibrant like this but that one was like a little bit darker more of a true blue whereas this almost has like a turquoise to it in a way but it's not like too turquoise I don't know let me know what you guys think I really like it um yeah very happy with it the next thing I'm gonna do is learn how to style this type of haircut I've just been wearing it naturally because I just never style my hair but um, I do want to learn how to do that okay that's all thanks for watching see you guys next time peace